Good morning, everybody. This is Dome Rock, BLM area. There's Dharma, just chilling. There's some cactus over there. Let's see in the background. This is basically, I was trying to figure this place out. <clears throat> Hi, how you doing? I was trying to figure this place out, right? And this, when I said there was no designated place in America for homeless, that's not true completely. This is. I looked at the map. Basically, Quartz is like a, an X on the map, right? It's a four-way road. Got Highway 10, and then you got 95, or 4, or whatever. <clears throat> but on both sides of Quartzite, which is the town right over here, is BLM. Plus, BLM's over here. I'm not sure there's more BLM on the other side down the road a little bit. Basically what that allows you to do is you, I can camp here at Dome Rock for 14 days and then I can go to the south end of Quartzsite in 14 days and then the north end for 14 days or whatever. Basically the idea is you cannot stay here for more than 14 days in a spot and when you leave you cannot come back for 30 days. That's the rule. So you, if you're gonna stay, if I was gonna stay in this spot right here for 14 days and leave, I cannot come back to this spot for a, a month. So for 30 days. So this allows people to actually live here, rent free in Quartzsite. And then I was like, you know what Quartzsite? I was trying to figure out because I drove into Quartzsite and it was like a, yeah, it was a very interesting vibe. I'm not, sh you know, very a lot of travelers, a lot of. Yeah, yeah, a lot of just stuff for sale. All it's yeah, it's kind of like a carnival. I'm trying to figure it out. Kind of almost reminded me of like the Dead shows, the old Grateful Dead shows. Um, the parking lot used to be more of a ish, uh, more of a thing than the actual concert. It was just like a bazaar of all kinds of different weird stuff you could buy, and people drugged out on stuff, which is not always good. But anyway, <clears throat> that was a Grateful Dead show. But here's another interesting thing about calling that town Quartzsite was basically. It's on top of a, just a huge quart mine all over. And I don't know if you can see it, if I can show you. Like this below me is all quartz. And it's just like there's a quartz vein right here. And they're all over the place. And I was like, that is so freaking cool. And I actually stood on top of one over there. Yesterday I was walking around and you could feel the vibration as you're on top of the quartz. Like just because the quartz has a different frequency because of the density of it and all that. But yeah, it was really bizarre. <clears throat> Plus, also, as an artist, I thought it'd be kind of cool to take some of it, because there's most of it, is, there's like veins of it, but it, it, the rest of the, you know, the desert's just brown or whatever. So it st stands out. So if you get a bunch of big quartz rocks and you can make like designs and stuff. I already made like a little squirrel by my, by Dharma. But anyways, you know, it's just, I'm, you know, I'm an artist. I'm trying to figure out, you know, if I'm going to hang out here for a minute, maybe I can do some like, do some art on the landscape. I don't know. I just think it's really cool. Um, I love the fact that I woke up and I wasn't freezing my ass off, which is always nice. And I'm, yeah, I'm kind of digging the environment. A lot of rolling little hills. So, I mean, I'm surrounded by other people, but I didn't even, except for this dude's generator over here, who's running all night. Jerk off. Anyway, <clears throat> there's no rules here at BLM, so you just, you can either be a douchebag and run your generator all night long. But, you know, people like the comforts of home. You know, I mean, if somebody's got a grandma and she needs to stay warm, then God bless her and run that fucker. I don't care. But if you're just, you know, because those things are so annoying. Like the weed blowers. Anyway. But if you look at it, there's the rolling hills. Yeah. So there's room. You can park anywhere. It's not as bad. There's, 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 it's not as bushy as some of the other places I've been to. Like uh, Chiriaco Summit, you can't just drive around. You'd be run over bushes every five seconds. But here there's a lot of open space. Just kind of neat, and a lot. I noticed, as I was walking around, a lot of pits. So yeah, and I'm thinking about I'm gonna explore some different parts of this area just to see what's you know, you know, what else am I doing right? It's not like I'm solving cancer at the moment, but I'm I have hope for that too. But the people in charge are just all wrong, just all the wrong people in charge. It's just the sad part is, is most of these people actually believe that these people are the good guys. Leave it on the high note. You're awesome. You're a miracle. I know it. You know it. And God knows it. And the universe knows it because they love you just like I do. 
And we want you to have a wonderful day, and hopefully this is working, because sometimes I can do a whole video and it's not a recording. <clears throat> anyway, yeah, Quartzite, Arizona. Maybe this will be my new home, my, my winter home. It's like I said, I woke up and I'm, I'm wearing sandals and I'm, I wasn't freezing, which is nice. Do I have a fire, which is probably going out, but it was complimentary. It wasn't necessary, but anyway. The only thing you got to worry about in the desert is rain. If it starts raining a lot, make sure you got some high ground so you're not, you know, getting washed away or something. Like right now, I'm kind of in a little wash, so if it starts raining, I'm going to find another spot. But anyway, I love you. Have a wonderful day. That's it. Okay. Little cool stuff. Yay, there's that dome or whatever. Okay, love you. Goodbye.